guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori, and today I'm starting the vlog. What is it? It's Wednesday. I got some chai tea. It's 5.46 p.m. I had to go in the office. I'm on my way home, and I decided to stop at Marshall's. <sighs> because Marshall's, right? All right, I'll show you what I bought. I got some vanilla elixir, no sugar added. If you're keto or sugar free, watch your vanilla. A lot of it comes with, they add sugar to it, but this one does not. It's just alcohol and the vanilla bean. So I grabbed a bottle, $5.99, which is not bad for real vanilla. And it does make a difference in my life. With keto, there's so many or so few ingredients, I wanna have good ones. Okay, I'm gonna need you to hold on to your hat for this. Are you sitting down? I got a gnome. Look at his little faux leather feet and hands and his fur and his body is sweater and his butt's full of beads and his little, oh my God, I love him. Um, so I think in my dining room over my I have an area that I decorate. I'm ordering, so you can do this and I can show you how I do it, sorry. I, you go onto Etsy and you look for printable wall art. So what it, you buy is a file that has a whatever picture you want. I wanted a reindeer, but like a real reindeer, not like Santa's reindeer, but like a real reindeer because I want to leave it up all winter and this gnome can stay up all winter. And so you get this file and you can print super large pictures. Then you go into Staples website and you print an architectural rendering of this super large picture and then you frame it. I did this um, in my living room. I think you've seen the cow, my Highland cow that needs to go back up. I just haven't figured out where it's going yet. Um, the frame I got at Goodwill for $2 and the print cost me $2.50 to print it or $2.78 and it was $3. So under $10, I have this huge wall art. So I'm gonna do the same thing. I have a frame in my garage that I think I'm gonna put it in. I may paint the frame and it's gonna go over it and then underneath it's gonna be like a winter sea. I'm so excited. And this gnome, we have to find a name for him. But my winter gnome, We'll go there. And it's something I can leave up. I'll put some Christmas accents and then take the Christmas accents down, but I can leave the gnome and all the white snowy stuff for winter. So excited. Time, did I say it was? 5.46. So we're gonna head home now. And what are we gonna do? We're gonna head home. Hmm, have some dinner. I need to show you my quilt top that I finished and my sweater that how far it's come. I'll show you later. All right, we'll be back. Okay, guys, this is my first ever quilt. This is a top. I have to finish it. <laughs> so the squares, let me see if I can get you in closer. These are all... I got them at the Fat Quarter Shop. They were all five inch squares. And then I bought the gray polka dot and I did all the outlining. Yeah, I love it. It's gonna be a couch quilt. So I need to put a backing on it and quilt it. So that's where I'm at so far. Hi guys. I just came out of Costco. It's Friday night. I need a few things. I'm kind of decided that I'm going to um, stock up for the next two weeks and just kind of lay low after the election. I don't know what's going to go on, but I just want to be safe. But I found something fun. I love Costco, especially around the holidays. Now, I can't have these, but I can certainly share them with my family. It's called a Stroop Waffle. And these are a Dutch classic and it literally means syrup waffle. So you have this waffle here and it's full of caramel. So there's two waffles and there's some car caramel in the middle. And what you do, 
pour a cup of hot coffee, tea, hot chocolate, and you literally sit it on top of your cup. And the steam from your cup melts the caramel in the middle and it warms up your cookie. This box was $6 and there's 40 in here. And I'm really, really kind of hoping that they're individually packaged. Because I would love to be able to split this box up. So it was regularly $8.99, but it was on special this week for $5.99. Um, and they only get this stuff in, I'm going to say, for the holidays. I've never seen it any other time. Um, or winter time, maybe. But, oh, I got it open. I mean, there's no way I'm gifting this whole box to one person. Oh, look. So you get 10. So there's four packages of 10. Perfect for gifting. Put this in a basket with some coffee or tea in a mug. Put this in a mug. Perfect gift. Perfect. Um, also, I'm going to take these one package to my cousin's house around the holidays. We do like game night and stuff. And I'll share with them. I will definitely gift one to my niece because I know she'll love them in her little Christmas baskety thing with some coffee. Whatever. $5.99 was a good deal, and that's a great gift to break up. So four packs of ten for five dollars. They were a little over a dollar a pack. What a dollar fifty a pack. Oh, I did math. Dollar fifty a pack on it. All right, we're headed home. I got a bunch of stuff. I went and got cat food at Target. Sorry. I'm putting the charger in. Woo! Phone needs to charge up. All right. Hi guys. I'm driving home from apparently my surprise party for my birthday. What? Crazy, my family, gosh, I love them. I'm so lucky and so blessed. I have a backseat full of pork rinds <laughs> because I love them and presents, oh, and cards and so many blessings. I thought I was going to watch the football game and I get there and it's a surprise party for me. What? I'm like, I already had my birthday. It's COVID year. Everybody wore masks. Um, and it was very safe and we all socially distanced and it was wonderful and amazing. And I wanted to share it with you while I drive home. It's midnight. The Buckeyes won. And I'm on a very quiet road. It's very safe right now. The Buckeyes won, and I visited with people I haven't seen in a while, and my family, my cousins came up from Cincinnati. It was wonderful, and I just wanted to share that with you. I'm so happy. I'm so thankful and so blessed to see friends and family that I haven't seen during this whole COVID. I just wanted to share it with you, and 50's not so bad. All right, guys, I'm going to get off here. Hi friends, it is Sunday. I think I videoed on my way home last night. My family and my friends threw me a surprise birthday party. Like how nice is that? Sorry, I'm unloading the dishwasher while I tell you these things. I also am going to be cleaning up the fridge. There's my balloons from the party. But not only did my family have a party, they went to a bakery that makes keto baked goods and got me keto cupcakes and cake for my birthday. What? Like, how nice is that? Hi, buddy. What you want? You want to say hi? <laughs> he said, no, lady, I don't want to say hi. I want you to feed me. It's not time to eat yet. Say hi. You say hi? Who's over here? Look at Say hi. Okay. I'll get you something in a second. Um, so they got me keto and everybody everybody brought pork rinds. So I have I haven't even gotten them in the house yet. I need to do that after I tidy up in the living room and mop my kitchen floor, but I have probably 20 bags of pork rinds in my garage right now. I am set for some time which is pretty darn awesome if you ask me. And they're all different. Oh, I love my family. 
two of my cousins came up, or three of my cousins came up from Cincinnati. So about an hour and a half, or actually they live in Kentucky. Uh, like a two hour drive, I have to guess, maybe a little more. I mean, it was so nice, so sweet. I was so nice. And yes, it's during COVID, but we were all socially distanced as far as that goes. And we wore our masks, which is nice during the party and then we watched the football game it was just a lovely evening and then they sent me home with all the food so i'm trying to figure out my refrigerator situation here so i can get everything put away tidy and get to everything you know but i'm also trying to wash my coffee maker because i would like to make some fresh coffee it's almost four o'clock I really haven't done too terribly much today. Kind of taking a me day. Oops, hold on. I had to run the dishwasher or the garbage disposal. I also had to run the dishwasher today. I tell you, if it wasn't for cat bowls and coffee cups, I probably would never have to wash the dish, run the dishwasher. But I do. Do I need to put anything else in here? No. My floor is gross. I'm not gonna lie, I need to attend to that. And put all the stuff away. I'll show you what I brought back. Besides uh, cupcakes. Oh, I'm so excited for those. Some pistachios, those are keto friendly. Um, all the meats is and cheeses is. So that's keto friendly. They had a whole keto friendly section for me. <laughs> but my fridge before I left was a mess. And now that I'm back, it's still a mess. I, do you think that's an overkill for a little bit of celery? And then I made egg roll in a bowl for dinner this week, buddy. Um, and next week. Um, for those that don't know, so hold on. I'm wondering if I don't need to freeze some of this stuff. I also stocked up on um, food and stuff because I'm a little nervous about the election Tuesday. And what's gonna happen? People are kind of losing their minds these days. You know? But we'll see. So I kind of stocked up on food, so in case things happen in my area, I don't have to deal with going out. You know what I mean? Not that, I, I don't know. I don't know what's gonna happen. I just don't want to deal with it is what I guess I'm getting at. Hi, buddy. I'll get you dinner in a minute. I just gave them a bunch of treats because I also unloaded the cat food that I bought and all the treats. So I have a whole refrigerator full of food here that needs to get eaten. Oh, and then my cousin, oh, I love him. He smoked a brisket. And they sent me home with smoked brisket. So I have a lot of food, guys, that's already cooked to get me through. To get me through. I need to find a container for the celery. What do you think? Huh. I wonder if it'll fit in here. Let's see. Celery. Maybe. Um, so what are you guys up to? I just cut my lip. I don't know on what. Right? I love celery. And what I really love is celery with cream cheese and everything but the bagel seasoning. It's delicious. 
Oh, I'm still just so surprised from yesterday. Not surprised that my family would throw me a party. They're wonderful people and I love them all. I'm surprised we're having, I, I already saw everybody. Well, my family that was there. Oh, look. It's perfect. So we had like a pre-party. And by that, I mean, I saw Sarah, my niece, she and my cousin planned it. I saw Sarah on my birth, on the Thursday night before my birthday. And then I saw her on the Friday of my, after my birth, or on my birthday. And my brother came over that day. And then on the Saturday night, I saw Debbie, my cousin. I don't know. Maybe I should light a fire. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Whew. It's chilly tonight. It's going to drop down to like 28 degrees. But it's been so windy all day. I'm wondering if this is part of that tropical storm. I don't know. I made some coffee. This is the white chocolate from Aldi. The gingerbread was delicious. The white coffee chocolate's okay. I have not tried the peppermint mocha yet of the holiday blend. But I thought I would show you my birthday stuff from last night. Or from like my birthday pork rinds. My family knows me. I like coffee and I like pork rinds. So first my work folks brought me, I think I ate one. And my cousin brought me some, so I might be missing some pork rinds. I don't know, but here's two bags that I got the other day. And then last night, oh, here's one bag I brought with me. I thought I was going to watch a football game. So I brought pork rinds because there's always some kind of dip I can have. Then I got Mac brand, which I love, salt and pepper. Those are delicious. And just so you know, my family doesn't allow me to open these in the car. I'm just saying. Um, ooh, and I got some extra crunchy from Matt Brand. Delicious. They also got me a pill holder that says very old. And the front says geriatric generation super pill keeper. I'm using it. I'm going to use it. And then I got some of these fun little gag gifty thingies. I'm on the hunt for something else, too. Aww. I also need to send thank you notes to everybody. So that's another thing. We're sitting here doing this so I can... Oh, and my the one family brought me keto stuff, guys. It's keto pancake mix. These little cups that you can make your own pancakes. Oh, I can't wait to try it. And then Keto and Go Fudge Brownie Mix. Right? And then Banana Caramel Muffin Mix. I've never seen these before and I'm super excited. Um... Oh, Erythritol. Fiber, inulin, monk fruit, coconut flour, cocoa powder, salt. Doesn't that look delicious? I can't wait to make those. So I got a bag of keto approved baking goods, which is nice. Put that in the bag that says love. <laughs> Guys, my family is funny, just so you know, and our friends. All right, I'm dumping out more. Please hold. Um, we got barbecue, barbecue, original, original, oh, and I got cheese wisps, these are my favorite, I'm going to, I might keep these for vacation, then we've got, oh, my friend, uh, my friend, my niece Sarah got me from Yoder's. These are from Amish Country, hot and spicy. And original. Oh, there's more. Oh, and these are delicious. I've had these before. These are um, sea salt and black cracked pepper. 
And these are hot and spicy. Oh, there's more. And these are barbecue, all different brands too, which is super fun. And then these are, ooh, kimchi and barbecue. I'm gonna like that. That's exciting. All right. Mm, I might be missing a card, maybe. I got this card that says I'm so old. It's true. And they got me. Oh, this candle gardenia scent. It smells so good. And then I got a couple other cards which I need to locate. I don't know where they went, but I will find them. So that is everything that I got last night. All my pork rinds. I don't even know how many bags I have, but we'll figure that out. Yep, I know I'm missing two cards, so I need to locate those. All right, everybody, you have a good one, and I will talk with you later. Is a little bonus footage of Walmart's Christmas section. I was gonna make it a whole video, but I decided to add it on here today. So I hope you enjoy.